Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Happy New Year, happy Veganuary. Today I'm sharing a recipe with you. It's a tofu scramble. I know everyone and their cousin has a version of tofu scramble and of course I have my own take on it. The weather has been dull and dismal lately and we all find this dish to be very comforting, especially as a breakfast. Cheese. And when I say all of us, I am including Mahi in that. Even he enjoys this tofu scramble. So I'm gonna give you a look at his reaction to it as well a little later in the video. I am just prepping my veggies. And when it comes to what you wanna add, just work with what you have. If you have frozen peas or frozen vegetables, you can do that. I had some lovely green capsicum that I got on sale this week. So I'm including that as well as some onion. And of course, a little bit of tomato. Now the tofu itself, you can use anything from medium firm to extra firm. The texture of course will be different in each of those cases. I'm using here a medium firm tofu and that's gonna give a mouthfeel similar to a slightly runny scrambled egg. Now in the hot oil here, I've got some cumin, black mustard seeds, asafoetida, karipata, just based on that, I'm sure you can see where this is headed. My take on the tofu scramble is somewhat Indian inspired, so I guess you could call it a masala tofu scramble. Now I have here the onion and capsicum cooking. I added some salt as well to start building those flavors. And I'm showing you the green chili, but I'm not adding it because Mahi is also gonna have a little bit of this. I added some tomato and I'm adding now some additional spices. All of these, by the way, are listed for you down in the description box. And I'm going to allow these ingredients to cook down a little bit. I'm not adding any additional moisture. I'm gonna cover it up and I'm trying to get a bit of charring on these veggies, which I think I have successfully done. As you can see, it's not burnt, it's charred. And I'm not going to deglaze the pan either because when I add the tofu that will have enough moisture to deglaze the pan for me and that will help to incorporate all this flavor that we've built at the bottom of the pan that's all going to be incorporated Although I did break up the tofu with a fork I'm continuing to mash it a little bit with my spatula. You can see the pan is nicely deglazed here. All of that beautiful charring on the veggies and on the bottom of the pan is now mixed up with this tofu. I'm gonna reach for one of my favorite ingredients here. It's the Billy black salt. It's actually Billy, which is the Hindi word for cat and there's a cat on the bag as well. A little of this goes a long way. Black salt is gonna add a slight egginess to it, if you will. If you're new to black salt, I recommend exercising caution when you work with it the first time. It's very powerful. Uh, this is a good time to taste your scramble, make any adjustments that you need to make. Add a bit of fresh dhania to just wake it up. You can add any herb, like dill would also be beautiful in this. And then just to bring things together, I'm gonna add a little bit of vegan mayo. If you don't have mayo of any kind, you can also squeeze a bit of lemon juice, but something about this vegan mayo gives it a creaminess almost, and it really just gives it a very convincing texture, something very close to scrambled eggs, or in this case, masala scrambled eggs or egg burji. I'm serving this with my favorite uh, focaccia, just toasted and lightly brushed with some butter, vegan of course, for this month, and um, there you have it, the tofu scramble. It's warm. It's warm. Not cold. No, it's not cold. And it's not hot. It's warm. Too warm? It's not too warm. I love to have this before I go to the gym. I might not have uh, two pieces of toast, maybe just one in that case, so I'm not too heavy, but. I do find that this is a wonderful, filling, hearty, satisfying dish, especially as a breakfast. And I'm happy to say that even Mahi enjoys it from time to time. And of course, Pranav is also a huge fan. Hot. No, it's not hot either. It's warm. But it's not too warm. 
Little bit too warm. Do a little bit too warm. Do it's a little bit too warm. Little bit too warm. Okay, then let's wait a few minutes. Be cool, really, really cold. I don't want to eat it when it's really, really cold. Thank you for spending time with me today. I hope you liked this video, and if you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel. I am getting back to working on this channel, I promise. I'm saying this to myself more than to you, really. But um, definitely subscribe, and I'll see you very soon.